Okay. Good evening. Welcome to Math Number One Fifty. Math Number One Fifty. So uh, today, uh, as part of your math stuff you were doing, you were looking at the nineteen eighty seven American Junior High Math Exam, and uh, problem number twenty five is a pretty cool one. Ten balls numbered one through ten are in a jar. Jack reaches into the jar and pulls out a ball. Then Jill reaches into the jar and pulls out a different ball. The probability that the sum of the two numbers on the balls is even is what? And this one gave you a hard time, right? Yeah. This is a hard problem. So, what do you think? Well, we know that odd plus, e plus, odd, plus odd is even. Yeah. Odd plus even is odd. Okay. And even plus even is even. Alright, so how are we going to get an even number? Well, when Jack picks out a ball, he's got five of them are even and five of them are odd. Right, right. So he's got half even and half odd. Okay. Then when Jill pr pulls out a different ball, if Jack, say he pulled out an even one, yeah, then Jill would have four ninths chance of picking an even and five ninths picking an odd. And that's if Jack picks out an even or yeah. not? An even. An even. Okay, so this is Jack picks out an even. Jill has four ninths chance of picking an even, five ninths picking and an odd. And it's the same for, for in for an odd except e. Except it's four nights odd, five nights even. Oh, ah, okay. Now, how did you figure that out? That's a very interesting observation, actually. Well, you've got nine balls left. Yep. Yeah. Then four even, five odd. Okay. Because? Because Jack picked one out already. Jack picked an even out. There used to be five even, five odd. So, actually, this is a great observation. A really great observation, actually. So we need the sum on the balls to be even. We want the sum. Well, no, 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 no. We want the probability that the sum yeah. of the numbers on the balls is even. So if Jill picks an odd, it won't. It it won't work. Right. Or if Jill picks an even, it will work. Right. That's one of the good outcomes. Mm -hmm. And the other good outcome is if Jack Jack picks an odd. And then Jill picks the odd. And how often does that happen? It's going to happen four ninths. Four ninths. And then five ninths. Five ninths, okay. So what do you think the overall probability that you get the sum of being even is? Well, we need good outcomes over total outcomes. <coughs> That's exactly right. So we've got, we've got the first half of... Jack picking mm -hmm. times what times four five ninths times four ninths. Right. No. What are the good outcomes? The good outcomes circle them is four ninths even and four ninths odd. Okay. How often are we in this bucket? The even bucket half yeah. of, half of the time. So half the time we're in here, and how often do we get an even sum here? Four ninths of the time. Okay, and half the time we're here in the odd, and how often do we get an four even ninths. sum here? Also four ninths of the time. So when we're in this bucket, we win four ninths of the time. When we're in this bucket, we win four ninths of the time. So how often are we going to win overall? We're going to win. What do you multiply the four ninths together? Sixteen over eighty-one. Yes, yeah, it's, it's one last tricky thing. So in this bucket. Half the time I win four ninths of the time. In this bucket, which is the other half of the time, I win four ninths of the time. So this is actually four eighteenth. This would be four eighteenths of the time. Four eighteenths of the overall times. Yeah. And how much would this be of the overall times? Four eighteenths. So it's eight eighteenths. Which is? Which is you have to divide by two. Yeah. So it's four ninths. Four ninths. Same. See, no, no matter what bucket you're in, you win four ninths of the time. Yeah. So that means overall you're going to win four ninths. four ninths of the time. Okay. Um, this is a really great job for, we've never really studied probability. Yeah. But 
you thought about it exactly right. You just needed to sort of, you know, push a few things together. But very good job, actually. Very good job.